Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the 27th, okay, or the full moon. So, why don't, why don't we just call this a full moon reading, right? Is it the full moon? When is the full moon? I got it on February. Hold on, let me look at my calendar. Obviously, I haven't watched anybody's anything. Full moon is on the 28th. So we can still call it a full moon reading because the full moon energies are coming in right now. So, but what do we have for around the 27th or the 28th or whatever? <sighs> I haven't even changed my calendar from February yet. Oh my goodness. What do we have for a message? What do we have for a message today? What is coming in in the next couple of days? Nine of Swords reversed. Why? Wow. Looks like a nightmare. <laughs> it started off with a nightmare because, you know, you don't forget who you're watching. Anyhow, um, that's a nightmare. Nine of Swords reverse is a nightmare. And this is fear. This is paranoia. So I'm not sure what is going on. Um, but this is in the past. So all is not as it seems. It's an unclear and difficult path. Um, this is giving deep thought to a relationship, uh, very stressed out. People love to honk their horns around here. Um, somebody's very stressed out. They could be having some really bad dreams, maybe even having nightmares. Um, they could be involved themselves in a situation that they are not seeing clearly in the past, obviously. Um, this is a lack of spirituality. We have somebody here that's having a hard time because of society. There's some sort of disgrace here. We could have a broken marriage, a broken relationship, a broken commitment, um, lies, uh, night, night of wands reversed. So this is reckless behavior. That's what is coming. This is, this is somebody that is, we've been talking about this person. I mean, the Knight of Wands in reverse is an individual that is a show-off. This is somebody that is loud, obnoxious. Uh, this is a sudden arrival, a, an impulsive decision. Somebody's about to make a very impulsive decision. That's what's going to happen. There is some sort of disgrace. There even could be public Disgrace, you know, with the hero font reverse. It could be dealing with a father figure that is disgraced. Um, nine of Swords reversed. Very extremely stressed out. We have somebody here that is stressed out, extremely stressed out. And they may, uh, you know, I gotta be, be just let you know, the, the moon can be addictions. So I wonder if we have somebody here that has some addictions, but it doesn't have, could be fearful, could be paranoia, could be, um, well, there's obviously something that has been below the surface, right? It's been, it's been hidden below the surface. Maybe there's even some secrets because the moon is ruled by the shadow. So everything is not as it seems. Somebody is coming in out of nowhere. This is a very sudden entrance. This is impulsive behavior. Uh, this person is uh, very gutsy. I feel like we have a gutsy individual that um, is... <laughs> Hold on, I gotta get another, another card. Um, what is this Knight of Wands reversed? Three of Wands. Look at all the wands. Very feisty. We got somebody here that uh, is extremely feisty. 
they've been waiting for the moment because this is a spur of the moment decision and this is waiting. Somebody has been waiting for the perfect moment to do something and whatever it is that they are doing, I don't think it's good. Okay, I just got to be honest with you. I don't think it is in uh, good faith. Okay, it's not in good faith. It's not. This, this person is extremely egotistical. Extremely. They are in a deep, dark place and they are depressed. So I feel like we have an individual that is in a dark place and they are under a lot of social pressure. And I feel like there is some sort of... There could be some uh, mental problems here. We could have somebody here that has a mental uh, illness, okay? Just being honest, this person uh, has been waiting for the moment to make their entrance or to do whatever it is that they're going to do because of this Knight of Wands reversed and this, this is for a moment decision. There could also be a sudden departure, a sudden arrival or a sudden departure. Um, there's illness here. There's some sort of illness. Now, i got to show you what's on the bottom. Judgment reversed. So judgment reversed is could definitely be ill health. Okay, this is somebody that doesn't listen to any advice that is not answering the higher call. doesn't tell the truth we have this person doesn't believe maybe doesn't believe in a higher power this is doubt there's some sort of self-doubt here there's doubting that they will be judged don't care about consequences we got somebody here doesn't care about the consequences okay they're gonna do something it feels like they're gonna do something crazy and I'm not trying to scare people but we do have a full moon coming up, and that's when the crazies come out, okay? And that's the truth. Leave it up to me to remind y'all that the crazies come out on the full moon. I don't speak politically correct, and I don't care. So, um, yeah. Four of Swords. This is the death of a situation. It is. It's the death of a person or idea. And I know some people really don't want to hear that, but that really looks like, you know, it looks like, you know, we could pretty it up and say, oh, somebody's sick and, you know, they're going to the hospital and that could certainly be the case or they just need to take a break. Well, somebody could die. Hopefully that's not the case. Um, mm. death of a situation, death of an idea or a person. We have somebody that is ill. They, there is some sort of sickness here. There is some sort of sickness here, and it could be a mental illness. It could definitely be a mental illness. Um, and this is a warning. Proceed with caution. It is definitely a warning. There is something going on that you cannot see. It is hidden. It has been hidden. Somebody may have been hiding their illness. And it may not be a mental illness. It could be an illness within, okay, another kind of illness. This is getting prepared for a departure. Get prepared for an arrival or a departure, okay? You know, it's like that card, Momento More, right? Death is real, okay? It's a real thing. It's not something that can be hidden. It's not something that we should not talk about. It's real. Mortality is real. Everything dies at some point. The only reality in life is that we aren't going to be here forever.
So anyhow, I think that we have somebody here that is ill. Okay? They are ill. There is some sort of illness here. And I feel like, you know, there's going to be a sudden arrival or a sudden departure. Uh... The Hierophant reversed is somebody that isn't very spiritual, perhaps, that it breaks rules, this is a rule breaker, does the opposite of what they say, and hides who they are very, very well. And I'm saying that because of the moon. This We have somebody here that is hiding themselves they're hiding who they truly are very, very well. They may be hiding their illness. Okay, whatever their illness is. I feel like you should get prepared. Okay, you should get prepared. Um, we have this person has been undecided. So whoever is either exiting or entering has been indecisive. Okay, they've been trying to decide whether they should stay, whether they should go, when is the right time, what should I do? You know, that's been what's been going on. There's been a delay, but I think things are going to start to move extremely fast with the Knight of Wands reversed. Could be dealing with a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, could be dealing with a Taurus, a Pisces. Uh, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Whew. Looks like we have somebody that has a lot of fire in their chart. Very, very, very feisty. Okay, this person uh, is strong, determined, uh, determined to take action. So we have a very strong, courageous individual who is finding their strength and courage to do something. Okay, they're going to do it. There's no stopping this person. This person is decisive. Their mind is made up. So we do have an individual that has a vision. This is a visionary. This person knows what they want. They're going to do it. This person is definitely action-oriented. Get prepared. Get prepared for some action, okay? You know, typically the King of Wands and the upright is very honorable, you know? So it's interesting. So... We could have the end of a, of a marriage or the end of a commitment. That could be what's dying. There's secrets. There's lies. This is a nightmare. Somebody's giving deep thought to everything that has happened. They're stressed out. Maybe they're, 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 they can't sleep at night, extremely exhausted. And, you know, I've talked about this before. When, when you're exhausted and you're stressed out, it can bring on illness. It can bring on illness. We definitely have somebody that is finding their strength and their courage to depart from something. Maybe this has been nothing but a nightmare. This is hoping and praying for the best. Waiting for the perfect moment. I feel like the moment is now. I do. I think things are going to happen fast. Really, really, really fast. This could just be a sudden decision that is made. Hmm. Nine of Swords reverse. Somebody does not have good intentions. We have somebody here that has been maybe in fantasy. Because if the moon is fantasy. It's not seeing clearly. The truth is hidden by the shadow. Somebody may have not been seeing clearly the truth. 
It may have been in their illusion, in their fantasy about a commitment or somebody that they were committed to. This is a new vision. It really is. This is a visionary. Getting prepared to leave. Getting prepared. Get, somebody's been getting prepared. They've definitely been thinking about it a lot. A lot especially at night when they're in bed. Especially when they're laying down, you know, when they're in bed. They've maybe been having nightmares or dreams about somebody, maybe even somebody from their past. There could be, in with judgment reverse, there could be feeling guilty. Somebody may be feeling guilty for what they have done in the past. Because judgment is about the past, the moon is about the past as well. So somebody may be feeling guilty about what they've done. Now this is doing the right thing. Like I said, the king of wands is typically very noble. I feel like, what is this Four of Swords? What is this Four of Swords? Exhausted, extremely fed up. Somebody is sick of it. They're sick of it. They're sick of hiding it. They're sick of hiding something. Not unrequited love situation. Somebody is in a situation that where there isn't reciprocation or there's it's unrequited love sick of the illusion sick of the fantasy this is sick fantasy sick of the illusion you know somebody may be waking up if that's the case congratulations it's interesting that i mentioned death everything dies anyhow eventually unfortunately that's the truth Anyway, the Knight of Cups reversed is a heartbreaker. This is a broken engagement, a withdrawn invitation. It's a cancellation of events. There could also be an emotional upset here. There could be some tears that are shed. So I'm not sure what is going on, but this is sadness, heartbroken over something that is ending. So there could be some tears that are shed. There absolutely could be. I would say get prepared for some news, okay? Get some prepared for some news. Whatever this news is, it's going to affect your feelings, okay? You're going to be receiving some news. This is going to make you emotional. There could also be, this could be the end for some of you. Somebody has been waiting for an arrival. There's been a delay. And somebody is coming in out of nowhere. Feels like it's a very fiery energy. Maybe they've been feeling isolated, feeling extremely alone, maybe even feeling dead inside. You know, not seeing that something was coming. I don't know who this is for, but we have, I think there's somebody, all of us, whoever's watching this, is unaware that somebody is coming. And, how, and this person is coming out of nowhere. Okay, and I don't know what your circumstance is. It feels like uh, we do have loneliness here. We have isolation. We have sick. We have depressed extremely extra depressed over maybe perhaps no commitment, so no relationship. I mean, I could go all day with these cards. There's so many people that watch this extremely stressed out, all alone, tired, exhausted, you know, uh, it's, nothing is showing up. It's below the surface. It's been below the surface. There's been a delay. There's no relationship. There's no lover coming in. Well, if that's the case, things are going to change really fast. So that's somebody's story. There is going to be an arrival, okay, that changes everything, okay? Get prepared. Get prepared. And maybe this time alone or this time of isolation was getting you prepared, if that's for you. We also have a sudden departure here. Somebody is leaving behind a commitment. 
that is dead. There could be good news coming in. There could be an offer of love that is coming in. Somebody that is uh, flirting, you know, we could have some flirting going on. We could have uh, somebody that is sending a welcome message of love, an offer, an invite, something like that. Whatever we have is we, we this is very a very um, passionate offer okay this is a very passionate determined strong courageous individual who protects this is the protector very decisive fearless dude this person is fearless unstoppable this person may see something and just go for it like run They may just get this vision that they have to do something. Okay, spur of the moment. I got to do this. Anyhow, beware. All is not as it seems. Somebody is coming in out of nowhere. Good luck.